going on, buddy? This is Kevin. You're looking at a Vantage. This is my uh, boat right here. That's a side console. It's a little fogged up. Let me clean this. There's a center console one. But basically, you can see how big that spray rail is. Okay. You can see the boat. See the side console. We are out running today, but it's 196. Adam, somebody behind you. 196, 80 inches wide. Here's a 90 on it. This is a Honda three blade speed prop. You can see right there, I got the 8, the 10, and the 12. Now that starts down at the deepest point of the boat. Average depth is under 8 inches with this setup. Uh, eight and a quarter, eight and a half when you got it with the live well full and you know you got uh, trolling motor system, power pole and stuff but 14 and a half degree dead rise very sexy boat very very shallow for as big as it is but remember the Vantage was built for the ride you know it, on paper it's designed and doing exactly what it was intended to do um, that's why we recommend a 90 to a 150. I would never underpower a boat just to try to save draft. And then save that number and use it for all different brands of horsepower, which is why I asked you what setup. Um, here you got the 115 HO, which is really a 130. That's a center console, jump seat configuration, 24 volt trolling motor, heavier build. But uh, going back to the seating, like we discussed, you could fit three seats right across the back. Okay? One, two, three. And they go right on the hatch. You could do a pedestal seat right here next to the side console. Pedestal seat 